Hello, this is Pastor Mark coming to you with another promise and a prayer. And here's a proverb for today. Proverbs chapter 10, verse 9. He who walks with integrity walks securely, but he who perverts his ways will become known. In other words, it's going to be found out if we've been cutting corners or doing things in a way that God does not want us to be doing them. But notice that first phrase. He who walks with integrity walks securely. There's a lot of things in life we can't control. You can't control the weather. You can't control what other people do. You can't control the economy. You can't control governments or world events. There are so many things we have absolutely no control over. But there's one thing we all have control over, and that is our own integrity. Will we continue to walk the way God has called us to walk? If we are willing to do that and asking Him to enable us to do that, this promise tells us that we will have a security in our life. So what is integrity? Integrity simply means that everything fits together in harmony. That's literally what the word means. And so my life with God and my life with other people, my private life, my public life, it all lines up. There's no uh, hypocrisy anywhere. There's nothing hidden in one area and, and then indulged in in another area. No, it's if you walk in integrity, God says, you will walk with security. And that is the one thing you are control, in control of. And so today, make up your mind that you will depend upon the grace of God and the, the encouragement of the Word of God and the strength of the Holy Spirit within to help you walk today with integrity. Let's pray. Father, I thank you today that you desire for us to walk in integrity, and that's for our own good as well. That as we walk in integrity, we have a security. And so we ask you to do a work by your spirit, a work by the word we've received, that we would truly live today the way you would have us to live. That every area of our life would line up and be in harmony with what you're doing in us. And we thank you for this in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, if you want new content daily or full-length sermons, go to vcachurch.com as we're overcoming together.